I used to think a wedding was a simple affair. Boy meets girl, boy and girl fall in love. He buys a ring, she buys a dress. They say I do. I was wrong. <laughs> That's getting married. A wedding is an entirely different proposition. My sweetest love, I am grateful to God for you. Today is the day we've been anticipating so eagerly for months now. Today we become one flesh, which is so much more than sentiment. Your mission becomes my mission. Your family becomes my family. Your legacy becomes my legacy. Drew and Sarah, you've made it. Sarah, this is the day you've been dreaming about since you've been a little girl. Drew, this is the woman you've been dreaming about since you are, well, forever. <laughs> and, and I am just so excited for you guys. <laughs> I have anxiously anticipated and prepared for this day for months. I do not know what to expect on our wedding day but I know it will be the best moment of my 24 years on this earth. saying that I once thought a man like you was unrealistic to hope for. Lord knows, he would have had to be the most patient man alive to be able to handle this constantly looping and spinning emotional roller coaster. But here you are, very much real and choosing to be married to me. It still feels bizarre looking down at my hand and seeing such a stunning ring, reminding me of our unwavering and steadfast commitment to each other for the rest of our lives. Can I give you guys a hug? Yeah, yes. <laughs> Nobody gets our makeup on her dress. <laughs> I won't, I promise. <laughs> hmm, I thought I was prepared. <laughs> you look beautiful. Thank you. Thank mm. you. You excited? I'm, I'm a little nervous, but I'm good. I'm nervous. <laughs> Don't cry. I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to. <laughs> I'm getting a little nervous, but I'm good. Hi, Heavenly Father, we're so thankful for this special day where we know that you are the one who brought Drew and Sarah together. And uh, we pray that you would be in the center of their marriage, that you would give them grace and forgiveness for each other. And when times are happy, that they would just be filled with joy, um, that you would uh, just protect their marriage um, and their relationship to one another. And we are so grateful and thankful for all the wonderful friends that you've brought here today to celebrate with us. You're marrying today not because you finally found the one who meets all of your selfish desires and self-centered needs. No, you are marrying today because you have found a person whom you are choosing to love over and over and over again, no matter how many death that requires of each of you. Sweet Sarah, today with my friends, family, and God as my witnesses, I vow to take you as my very own wife, to love you as Christ loved the church, to protect you, provide for you, and cherish you with all of my care and affection. 
and to lay down my life for you. My turn to try and hold it together. <laughs> Drew, my one true love, today with my family, friends, and God as my witnesses, I vow to take you as my very own husband. And while we met for coffee, you showed me a PowerPoint presentation <laughs> on why it would be a good thing for me to give you permission to marry my younger daughter. So for the men here contemplating marriage, I strongly recommend you get a copy of that PowerPoint presentation. I vow to take you as my very own husband, to never leave you and devote myself to you in love, to regard you as more important than myself. I vow to submit to you as the church submits to Christ, to be completely trustworthy, to respect you, and to look to you for spiritual guidance. I vow to lay down my life for you, to believe the best about you, and to be your friend who loves you at all times. I vow to preserve and uphold the covenant of our marriage and to intoxicate you always with my love. You are my very best friend and I can't wait to love you forever. I vow to be a friend who loves and adores you, to be captivated by your love always. You are the greatest gift that God has ever given me and I love you with all my heart. Drew, you may kiss your bride. Uh -huh. <laughs>